The most important thing that uh, I'm thinking all the time is that when I say more women in politics, I also want to say more men who want more women in politics because I realize that only those men who realize the importance of women participation in politics will, uh, toge together with them, we will be able to create better place in all over the world. And in that sense, I met some men and I understand that women also need to negotiate with them, cooperate with them, not just fight them, but, uh, and maybe not only, but there are some places that we have to. But I want them to cooperate with us and all those men who want more women in politics, we also need to support them to have shared and better places in decision-making processes, in, in uh, key positions, so that then more women can come into politics. Well, I think that in Croatia still uh, there is um, a lot of uh, burden on women in terms of uh, domestic life and taking care of the family. And uh, the, the whole uh, infrastructure is not uh, adjusted to their needs. And uh, as well, there are also this traditional role still. It is very, very um, present in Croatia that women are uh, for uh, taking care of children, that they are, uh, that the most of the uh, work at home is, is their work. So it is something that, that should change and that's what makes women, um, they, have, they don't have time uh, to, to enter politics or, for, or to do anything else pretty much uh, because of this uh, burden that is on them. I would like to emphasize one thing we need men in the struggle as well. Uh, to have highly educated, emancipated, ambitious women is not enough. We need understanding from both sides. Um, so oftentimes I'm asked how important is education for women and so on, and I always say as important as it is for men, uh, because we can no longer afford like we had in the past hundreds of years to invest in only one gender. We need equality and that means equality for men as well.